everybody, it's Demon as Keeper Class Triple Threes, and welcome back into Dangara for 2 Goodbye Despair. So, last time, well, not much, I was there. I did some free time for a little bit, I was there. I think the one I did hang out is I always did love Chucky all the time, and also. I don't know. I keep forgetting stuff, and I don't know. I don't oh, know for a fact that I love Jackie all the time because I always hang out with sometimes. Um, I don't know. I think I hang out with Necromara as well because I did one time for it. Because the other one of the three times I did was hang out with Jackie and Pekko. So that's what happened from before the motor starts. Okay. Yeah, that's the one thing I'm trying to remember so far. Like, they hang out with Necromara and Jackie the last part. So, yeah. And uh, more importantly, I did check out, uh, well, not to me, we've been checking out some kind of the Twilight Syndrome murder case. Like, it, that might be anything, it might be related about the Mildred thing. And he thinks it's like, um, I don't think it's not very helpful at all. But it's still a mystery to me, thinking it might be why the each day is a miss or a skip for some reason. Because it's only here for like the second and the fourth day, so. I mean, I'm not sure. I'm not the type of guy who knows anything about Twilight Syndrome games. I mean, it's this type of like, a typical horror game. I think it's something to do like, um, certain places and trying to survive. Even there might be some kind of like a haunted spirit and anything. I don't know, so yeah. That's the only thing I know so far, but it's the only thing I know anything I can think of, so yeah. And also, we got some more free times as well, but. It's only like a one free time event for this because of um, what happened uh, during morning time that Kazuichi talked to me about thinking about like they have a plan to think about like what I've been up to exactly so yeah and uh, speaking of which I better check out my pets as well ah there's some poop somewhere ah uh, they me to do that and it seems to me there's a spare meter on it as well like what am I supposed to do with it exactly so I'm supposed to get give more some hope on it and I did some uh, do off screen for a bit since I got some coins left and I thought for sure I'd give some of it. Mm. I wonder what can I give him my pet. Maybe some t shirts? No. All I got there is the spy spike shoes. I think it's just like, I don't know, some kind of like a speed shoes? Maybe for Akane would be like it. Uh, the patch of glasses. I don't think that might be very helpful for the snake. Um, what about the big fan? I'll be sure the pet like it. I'll get the whole meter toes up. And the despair meter is going down as well. Huh, that's cool. So I had to give them some gifts, and that way the despair meter is going down. So, anyway. So, what should we hang out first then? I know for a fact that I know Jackie's. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get hang out with Chucky. I mean, after all, I mean, she's like one of the favorite, and not importantly, uh, she was the only one left. Like, uh, only one more fragment, and I'll be good to go. But do I have any enough st uh, stuff I get for Chucky? Because you know for a fact, like, she's into games, so. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I use up everything, so. And. Even if there's nothing might be interesting for her, if she likes any kinds of stuff have. So it's might be hard. What about some snacks? I'm pretty sure she kinda of likes snacks that much, is she? Uh I don't know, there might be anything very interesting. Does she like any fat like I know she's the type of gamer who like eats snacks all the time, like I think so. I guess I give him some. You know what? Let's just hang out for Jackie a little bit. Let's see if she can have a chance to get some horror fragment. If not, then oh well, that'll be like a total waste. Who is it? It's just me, Jackie. Well, that's me. Eh, yeah, still the same place. Yeah, it did. It just looks like a potato chips for her. Like, she is the type of, uh, a girl who eats, uh, who has snacks with playing video games. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. I don't want to spend that much energy today. I think... I'd rather just sit still and read a book or something. You don't read books, you only play video games. Well, yeah, just hang out. Hey, hey. You wanna read too? 
Let's go to the library together. Do we seriously have to go to the library? I mean, you gotta be just sleep forever. I spent time today reading with Chiyaki. Even we don't know where it is exactly. Let's hope if she likes it. Uh, since I don't have not much. Not that blue ram, but <laughs> it's kind of weird. There's like a a trap of drink. It's like a Red Bull. Uh, potato chips. Yep. If you give this to me, okay, so I'll save it. Thanks. Yep. Thanks. Um. Um. There's somewhere I wanna go with you today. Is that okay? Yeah, of course. Anywhere is fine. It's the first time Shanky has picked the place herself. My heart is starting to race. <laughs> it's not the rush of being like, like between guy and girl, like doing date stuff. Shanky took me to the beach. For what? Oh, the beach from the very beginning. She's looking around for some reason. For what? Hey, why don't you pick the beach after all this time? Did you want to swim or something? No, I don't think so. I mean, not for a fact, because she she probably will drown if she sleeps. Ah, hmm. uh, in those types of games, usually, <sighs> you put lotion on my back, right? Ah, uh, not the way I was supposed to think. And then you touch me in a weird place and I'll yell at you. It is still authentic. Huh? Uh, which reminds me, what do you think the legendary tree is growing? What kind of game are you talking about now? Yeah, that's no make sense. What kind of game are you talking about? Is it about the beach simulators? <laughs> it might be a thing. Well, I should give you three choices for what we're going to do from now on. Please select from the following three. What? You want me to pick? Is this a new game of hers or something? I'll open a piece of paper Chunky gave me. A paper? Like, give me a list? Do I really have to choose one of those? Hot Chunky, happy, happy, joy, joy, celebrate in the ocean. Um, would that be really weird? Um, would that be really big? Hot Chucky? Then I hug Chucky? Just kidding! Oh, you were. I thought you were just kidding. If you did something that violence or something, it would have been very bad. All the flags in the store would have been lowered, and the effects she made it would have drastically decreased. Dang it. It's pretty difficult. It's not this, so... Uh, happy, happy, joy, joy? Happy, happy, joy, joy? What does it even mean? <laughs> I don't know what kind of game that might be is, exactly. Mm, I don't really know either, but it's probably something like this. So you just all made up, then. Suddenly, Chiaki start running. Um, catch me if you can! Uh, is that a name? Is that game attack? She continue running across this beach. I had no choice, so I chased after her. Is that a game of tag? Really? After chasing her around for a little bit, we felt really tired and sat down on the beach. Chucky, what in the world are we doing? Hmm, <sighs> I was thinking about overcoming the genre. I'm bad at it. Bad at? Oh, now I remember. The other day you mentioned that there are games you're not good at. Apparently, my father also wasn't good at things like this. Well, this is the most difficult after all. Hmm. But, hmm. I see. So this is what it feels like. Of what? Rushing in? Why do you feel convinced by yourself? Hey, hey. Just now. That was a thing, right? Uh, you not typically how you think it is, even though like a, a type of dating simulator or whatever. I think those are usually a little different. I just want to understand what Shaki meant when she said she's not good at this genre. She probably means... Daily Sims. They're just freaking saying it! I'm just thinking about this like, like a daily simulator or whatever. <laughs> it's not a, like a type of game that's like a playing like a visual novel game. It is like a thing that you can like date someone else's. Like who you love the most of it. I don't know. It's just like really weird. After spending time with you, I realized something for the first time. There are a lot of things I still don't understand. For example, I know how babies I made. I don't really know how to fall in love with someone. That's what I think. Why would you use that as an example? <laughs> it's not. Is it really too early to say where babies come from? No. There's no. Nothing to explain right now. No. What happened? Oh. What happened? Your face is red, Hatsumi. Because of you saying it! N nothing happened. 
Yep. Just as I thought. Just do a bunch of stuff I don't know anything about. I wanted to know more about lots of things. Because if I do, I'll be able to understand much more. I think. Well? So, can you keep teaching me, Hachimi? Yeah, of course. It seems to be your... She's blushing. But in order to do that, we need to hurry up and get off this island. <laughs> if we make it alive. Don't ever forget about me. Even after you get out of here. Okay, you gave me some voice for this one. Why well, won't do anything? Does that mean we may reach the end of it? Huh? I don't know why Jackie would say something like that. But it's still denying the strong bond I feel between Jackie and myself. I will definitely get out of here. It takes Jackie a lot of different places. Oh, please, I want to let her live. Yes! It's all complete! And then got leveled up to 21. Check his report harassment update based on your experience with her. And I got achievement Cora Partners. Oh my gosh, that means I got it all complete! Wow! It's like the same thing from the first one I did complete with Hifumi's. Uh, with all the complete bonds, and I got achievement for that, so it's all good. You just unlocked the skill! Cheat code! Give yourself a pat on the back. You earned it. Oh, I got skill for that? This is way different from the first one. Usually you only get the, um, where you complete your hanging out with your friends, uh, you might be able to get some skill points or some skills. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, like, wait till you get the end of it and get some skills? That's cool. <laughs> Holy Jesus, what the heck? You have tainted presents, Jackie's undergarments. Really? I just got her panties? Ah, uh, this is so very weird. This is getting very hentai around here somewhere. Oh, the kid's not gonna watch this. I mean, <laughs> not literally, but... Whatever! After discussing different ideas about where we should go next, I return to my room. So we got Chucky Dance all completed, so I want to know who else is going to be hanging out next. Looks like it's almost time to meet up with Kasuichi. Yeah, I knew it. So that means I only hang out one one thing at a time for doing free time. And I get the bad feeling there's going to be something that a murder is going to happen. Hopefully not. He told me to come to the supermarket. What's he thinking all of a sudden? And keeping it a secret from the others. I don't want to think about it, but if he's planning to, if he's thinking about like uh, trying to spy on Sonya, no. No, there's no way someone as carefree as him would do something like that. I just got straight towards it. Yeah, I just got straight towards it. I'm pretty sure he's gonna be here, right? Huh? It's well past the range time, and there's no sign of Kasuichi. Is he late? All of a sudden, the anxiety I had been keeping inside me began to swell up like a balloon unit. So, no! Like I knew finally came. Well, what are you been up to? What? Whoa! Really? Right away here, Hajime just screams and you screams. Hey! What the heck? Don't get all pissed at just because I was a little late. L late? Oh, I get it. I totally forget. I totally forgot he's that kind of guy. A guy who doesn't mind showing up late, even though he's the one who asked me to come. That kind of guy. Well, sort of makes sense. No, not really. I don't think so. So what do you want? Why do you call me out here like this? Hey. Well, you know, can you do me a favor? Well, it's not, if your favor is about like something to do with Miss Sonia, what calls something Miss Sonia? Jeez, Kasuichi, you just messed it with me. A little favor? Ah. Uh. I just overheard something. For who? Apparently, it's Miss Sonia's idea. For a change of pace. It looks like the girls are secretly planning to go splash around at the beach. Oh, uh, that's what you think about. But yet, you are still thinking about going with Sonia. It doesn't seem so secret now. Wait, don't tell me you. <sighs> I suspect that Miss Sonia splashing around in the sea is a nice idea. Don't tell me we just have to tag along, is that? Well, why can't you ask anyone else as well? Well, why can't everybody else getting get on the beach then? Whoa! I admire her so much, it's shocking! Her heart trembles around her, so much it's about to burn out! <laughs> so, let's crash it together! Uh, not really, because we like, only well, two guys here, it was like, the all girls gonna be here, that'd be really weird. Nah, that's, that'd be stupid. Well, why me? 
Hey, hey! Well, it's weird to fake a coincidence all by yourself, isn't it? So, how about a scenario where you and I go to the beach, and then we ran into the girls by coincidence? Huh? Hey, you better not say no. I can't ask any of the other guys to help me with this. Man. Nakamura can't keep his mouth shut to save his life. And Gundam as well. Gundam. <laughs> really? <laughs> well, I know for a fact he's just the type of guy who's so lonely. Only talk to his hamsters, whatever. It would be very weird if, if Gundam would tag along with us we'd go to the beach when our hamsters would. Well, well, well Sonya's gonna be so intrigued with her hamsters. Fuihiko and Nagito are out of the question. I understand where you're coming from, but I don't feel like going to the beach. Hey! hey I took the time to prepare your swimsuit, you know? Well, we are fat that we, me and Jackie went to the beach. We didn't go to the swimsuit, though. But we're just hanging out, that's all. And, and now you just gonna walk all over all my kind at? You're snapping at me? <laughs> it's not like a one snap that you might think of, but that was a reference. If you say no, I'm gonna bug you about it until you die. There's no way he's joking about that. This is a cut speech after all. If I have no choice, then fine. <laughs> Yahoo! That's my how to make. That's how a soul burst so should act. So, what do I have to do? So I just, like, plain and simple? Well... Well, based on what I overheard, it looks like they're going to the Candlelight Beach on the second island. Well, I hope this, the second island is going to be one heaven. And now a victim is going to happen. Alright! That's why we're going to head over to the diner first! Our plan is to be at the beach before they get there. And we're going to act like it's just a coincidence. Got it. So I need to go to the diner. Engine's ready! Yahoo! I get all excited now! Well, that makes one of us, I suppose. Looks like he can't take a hint. Well, I guess when I don't try it, two guys with all the girls? That's kind of really weird. Uh, I guess nothing to do around here, so I guess we'll just like, like, get to the the beach anyway. Well, fear not that I need to walk around paces to get more experience as well. So I make up a wise to get put the jump cut then. There's a gunner over here, I didn't see it coming. But oh, whatever. Um, I forgot, the second I go to the left. I guess I can't recall exactly where it leads to. Yeah, it was to the left. I was trying to remember. And then, from the beach, it's supposed to be to the left. Oh, that's Kazumichi! Where did you get here? For now. Looks like they're going to the Candelaria Beach on the second island. Alright! That's where we gotta head over there. Yeah, that's the same different before. But how did you get here? That'd be really weird. Yep, that was the closest. I was hoping there was like a to the left, not to the right. Well, we're here to the diner, so... I guess that might be a coincidence. I guess I have to call, talk to him now. <laughs> Alrighty! The ladies aren't here yet. Let's hurry up and go inside. Okay, we just have to go in there. Man, all you have to do is just wait. How the heck would I just have to wait here for a very long time then? <laughs> Alright, we're here. Now we just have to stake out a spot and wait until the ladies arrive. Is she sure about this plan? I mean, isn't this a little too stalkerish? Yeah, it was. I guess I have to sit, just talk to him, just get progressive. And when are they coming? And when are they gonna come? Did you happen to overhear that with your sensitive ears too? Hmm. They mentioned something about coming a little after the sun starts to tip. So maybe around 4 p.m.? It's 3 o'clock p.m. right now, so we still have to wait one more hour? <laughs> Always make your move early. That's just the basic, you know. Yeah, but doesn't mean you have to be staying forever. I don't know if you should be talking like an expert right now. Hey! It's fine, it's fine. Just make sure you keep it once by the window. It'd be bad if you didn't catch Miss Sonya on her way to the beach, you know? It's our job to keep that from happening. 
to get to the beach, they're gonna pass in from the diner. Engines ready. You better keep your eyes peeled. This isn't a game. If this isn't a game, then what is it? <laughs> it's like a spy. I really should have said just say no. <laughs> if you would have said no, the cause would be left behind. But you like the only guy on the beach, will, along with all the girls. Sitting at the table by the window, I rest my chin in my hands and absentmindedly stare at the window. This is this all day, for a whole hour. Oh, they're coming! They did arrive! It hasn't been, it hasn't even been ten minutes yet. Wait for a minute, then twenty minutes passed, then thirty minutes. Time passed by. The only things that grew were the volume of my sighs and weight of my regrets. <laughs> oh, I could hear you. How you feel, huh, Jimmy? <sighs> Say, what kind of swimsuit do you think Miss Sonia will wear? Since she's a foreigner, how about bikini? Um, how the heck should I know? I mean, I know, I know for the happened to do a prologue that we see her in school you, swimsuits, but. I don't know. Don't you feel like there's a pure, innocent, mythical fantasy hiding between the top and bottom of a bikini? Even though I want to agree with you, I don't know how to answer that. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I know, like, Sonya is the type of girl who's a princess, but I know. I kinda want to know why you like Sonya that much, Kazuichi. When will you know Sonya that much? Wait, huh? And that's when it happened in the corner of my eyes. I soon someone walk by in the front of the diner. Huh? Huh? Isn't it? I wonder what happened. I guess I should head over there. We left the diner in a hurry and ran to where that person was standing. Who would that bet me? It's not like you went past to the, the beach, is it? Oh, it's Fuhiko. Huh? You, you be? I know it's you, Fuhiko. What are you doing here? Shut the hell up! That's my line! <laughs> well, I'd like to know what you've been up to. Hey, hey! What the heck? You awfully tense. Actually, why are you seem so flustered? <laughs> Who are you calling a fluster? Don't go making a false accusation, you bee! Huh? Don't tell me. Aw, oh, man, is that it? You were here at my plan, didn't you? Huh? Plan? It seems to you you're not the only one, is it? Huh? No, you just playing dumb. You were here in my plane and followed us all the way here, right? Hello! Oh, hey, Bookie, you're here. Like, right in front of us? Hey, what are you doing in the place? Oh, my, my! That's a strange combo. Of uh, what? Between me and, F and Kazuichi and Fuyigo? Uh, hello! Hello! Um, today is another wonderful day. Well, you're done for! You're not gonna get away now that I caught you! Uh, it's not like for real, is it? Don't tell me you gotta do something crazy enough like put some syringe on us. Ah, I guess I'll never be in a pledge and not something weird. But please don't eat me. I'll take your punishment as much as you like. Wow. No. Oh, um, you too. This is such a, a coincidence. Is it too early for saying that, Kazuichi? Or is it you forgot the line then? Um, I never expected to coincidentally run into you guys here. He really does suck at this. <laughs> you need to get this line right. Well... Man, actually, Hajime and I were about to head to the beach together. Oh my! Huh? Could that be what your ladies are here for? That's such coincidence! It even seems like destiny! What coincidence for you, Kazuichi? Aww... Something always is suspicious! Your eyes are moving around like some some, and before I did lay eggs! How does salmon can I hit eggs? Or whatever! Well... No way! I always like this. Uh, how should I put this? I always pay attention to my surroundings. I, I can't keep watching this. As I suddenly look away from the embarrassing sight. What? I realize that he had disappeared. Wait, before you go, he ran out before we just did! Really? How the heck did he do that? Man, it's kind of invisible, does it? Huh? Where did Fuhiko go? Well... Well, regardless, you did arrive pretty early. It's only 3.30 p.m. You still have 30 minutes until you meet the others. Um... Um... Why do you know we're going to meet with the others? 
Because Cousinly JJ is over here. Why, you? Hey, you know a damn mini time! Hmm. Well, you see. For now. Anyway, let's share the coincidence that brought us together. So, is that okay if we join in too? Wow. You got forceful all of a sudden. Aww. So, that's your alternate motive. You're about here for Sonia, aren't you? Yep. Guilty as charged for Cosmic Team. Well, I really had no desire to do something so rude, like decline the offer, and all. But Sonia was the one who planned to go to the beach, so we need to ask her. Of course. Then it's all good. It's too devastating to think me Sonia would decline, so I just won't think it. Is he being an optimist or is a permissive? I don't really get it. <laughs> Neither do I, Hansmate. Right? Hey, hey! Hey, hey! Is it alright if we go inside now? Ibuki is gonna eat a good meal first. That's why I came early. Okay then. <laughs> sure thing. Let's wait inside. I can't take my mind off where go. Oh well, I come this far. I can't jump back now. Well, I want to know what Fuhiko been up to. It's not like he's hiding anything. Or whatever. Well, I'll just get back in, uh. Let's back inside then. Wait for a little bit. But maybe the probably some more girls will be coming in, so. I return to the diner and set myself at the table near the window once again. Phew! But I'm thinking I couldn't help letting out a big sigh. <laughs> Oh! What are you guys gonna do about your swimsuits? You aren't allowed to change in that beach house, you know? Um, yes! That's why we're already wearing it! <laughs> What's underneath this uniform is a panties! It's a swimsuit! What, you ain't just, like, put on your swimsuit already? Of course! Well, that's obvious! I also came wearing this swimsuit too! Huh? Really? Ah. Uh, Which reminds me, you're not wearing yours yet! Huh? Then you gotta go to the bathroom so you can change! Here you go! This is yours! Really? You give me- you give Hajime a speedos? What's that mean, really? Unnecessary? Wh what is this thing? <laughs> um, it may be rude of me to say this, but- <gasps> Then, that's another of the day! Are you serious? What if something falls out? If this is the end line, you're totally gonna get sent up by the neck bird! <laughs> Would that be weird? Well, it is to see him naked, but- Like, this also is speedos, but- Ugh! I'm gonna let anyone happen like this. There's, there's no inappropriate weird uh, nudity for this. <laughs> Don't worry. Even if it's worse, it won't turn into a live action drama. That's not the problem. <laughs> Who is that then? Are you telling me you don't want to match with me? It's it's a matching? Then I definitely don't want to wear it. Yeah, get your. Yeah, how do we get his own swimsuit then? Not yours. Your suggestion, Kasumi Jeep. I don't use man, so let's stop. Things are heating up something fierce. What's everyone's gonna come? I hope they come soon. And, and as she said that, Ibuki peeked out to the window. Oh! Huh? What is it? Look outside! Outside! What's outside? Oh. Isn't that Hyoko? Looks like Hyoko's running. She came from the beach, is it? Because she based on the direction is and I see her crying did something happen in the beach jeez don't get my hopes up I thought it was Miss Sonia doesn't she seem a little strange yeah like one thing why she's crying it's like she's running away for something if I had to describe it as a song title it'd be sprint of tears huh? it looks like she's running from the beach did something happen yeah I got a bad feeling about this Despite our questions, Hyoko ran by the front of the diner at full speed. Huh? She totally ran past us, but wasn't she part of the beach crew? Well, apparently she can swim, so she turned us down. Okay, she she didn't get invited as well, so I guess Hyoko wasn't part of it. Hmm. But she didn't she just come running from the beach? Uh, uh, I, I'm sorry, sorry, I don't really know all the details about that. Well, this means <laughs> women are full of surprise. Aww. Mayu is the type of totally to come, but she's willing to turn this down too. When would that happen? Is it the time when you were trying to ask her? Mahiru, she did? She turned it down? It's on expect of her not to join in an event like this. In fact, she totally planned this sort of thing. That's totally 
Oh yeah! Please get me help! Apparently she wasn't really feeling well. I don't know. Maybe my heroes might be hiding something. But who knows? Um, I'm terribly sorry to continue this topic, but why was your girl crying? Why are you asking us? But if she was sprinting away from the beach and crying, something definitely wrong. Like, what did happen in the beach? I hope there's not gonna be any murder that's gonna happen. Hey! Hey! Whoa! Why did you get here so suddenly? Oh, who's might be it? Cause I suddenly shout, and what he was looking at was near, near the diner's entrance. As I turned around... Oh my goodness gracious! My, my, how disappointing. I thought if I came early, I'd be the first one to arrive. Damn, Chiaki! You want your senses really that quick? Man, I kinda like it. It's all complete white, but... I don't know to judge it, but... Man, I kinda like your swimsuit, Chiaki. Could keep myself... I'm staring like an idiot. <laughs> That's what you think. I mean, we already got related, so... I got her hope fragments uh, completed. <laughs> Whoa, Chiaki! You came wearing only your swimsuit! Coincidentally? I didn't want to carry it with me. If I did, it'd be a serious burden. Would that be weird? Serious burden? That's a total exaggeration. But even though you didn't want to carry anything, it looks like you're carrying something. Instead of bringing lunch for everyone, I brought ice cream. Uh, was it a bit too early for that? I mean, I know for a fact that we're going to the beach. It is like hot, sweaty summer, I think. Um, it's not like I'm gonna turn it down, but... We always keep saying gonna turn it down. Ice cream is completely different from lunch. I don't think it can be used as a substitute. They consider it as a snack then. Also, I was thinking of stuff we could all do at the beach together. So I brought a board game too. Um, I don't think that... I don't think the board game is supposed to do it on the beach. Now to be... That's not how it works. Hmm. Should we play it even though we came all this way to go to the beach? Nah. Hey, we're just gonna take it out for a bit, right? We have to wait for the older girls, does it? I see. That's disappointing. What? I only wish I wanted to try it. <sighs> but, how should I say this? Is this what Gap Mall is supposed to be? For someone not normally so quiet to wear such a daring swimsuit, it makes you a little excited. Right, Hajime? Well, um... I don't know. That's what I said. But my heartbeat was actually getting faster and faster. <laughs> Seriously, man. I never expected a Chianki to have such huge jugs. Dude, really? Kazuichi, language! Is that very popular to all the ladies? What happened? Jugs? <laughs> That's what I mean by that. Let's literally. Um. Hey, hey, hey. I didn't say that just now! It was Hajime! He's, he's a pepper, you know? Really? You gotta take the blame on me, Kazuichi. What are you saying? Oh. I mean, I'm only have eyes for Miss Sonia. I dream of going out with a blonde lady ever since I was a kid. Really? You felt interested with Sonia when you were a kid? Seriously, I want to know about you. Like, why you still like Sonia that much? And is that really weird? Is this a kind of mold? Eh, not to just judge it by the her chest or anything, but. It does actually have a mold on it. Hmm. The size is a little small, but this is the one little only swimsuit that fits me. Really? Is it really that tight? Hey, hey. I don't look good in it. Huh? What? No, I guess you look good. Thanks. And I'm glad. I guess. You always keep saying I guess all the time. <laughs> wearing a bikini is so daring. And you get bonus points for wearing a white one. A point because of how her screen is white. Why that's not just stomping, it's stomping all sport I don't know how you said it. Like, but dum 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 but dum It's probably a heart attack. Yeah, <laughs> that boom boom boom. Something like that. Yo! Yeah. That's what kinda of sounds like. Hey! I get you waiting. We heard a voice of the dining door slowly open, and the person who walked through it was a Connie, is it? What the heck? Um. Hey, sorry to keep you guys waiting. Wait for what? For your blood coming all over you, all of your body. Oh, Akane! What happened to you? Did 
Did you get beat up or something? What? Is something wrong? I made sure to wear a swimsuit this time. Forget about the swimsuit. I want to know about the blood. Not that. Eat your wounds. It, it wouldn't be strange if we nicknamed you Carrie right now. Is that a reference or something? Uh, oh, you're talking about these. <laughs> On my way over here, I happened to run into Coach Nakomaru. Oh, of course. So you have it like another match again? I just gonna beat him up. And when that happens, I gotta fight him, you know. But you still end up fail. Why does she have to do that? Uh, are you really all right? Your head—it looks like it's split in half. Well, it'll heal as long as I rub some spit in it, right? No, definitely not. You're totally playing up the power of human spit. <laughs> I'm all fired up now. I never knew such a strong opponent even existed. Really? You ain't one of the strongest, after all. <laughs> anyway, you need to be treated. You also need your wounds sterilized. Akane, please come with me. With an unusually forceful demeanor, Mika pulled Akane into the bathroom. Well, I guess she had to treat her wounds. After all, she's a nurse. <laughs> That's why she's the ultimate nurse. Well, it's going to be okay if we leave it to her. Hey. Oh, is that Becca? I heard the voices. What is all this ruckus? All right. Oh, who is it this time? Oh my God, Becca! You come here that much? And why are you all wet? Hajime, Kazuichi, why are you two here? Did you call me Hajime? I'm pretty sure you got the name wrong. Hey, aren't you breathing pretty heavily? Did you went to the Did you went to the beach that early? I just did a little swimming. Really? I swam around the island for about three hours. Um, that wasn't that much. That's too obvious for me not to comment on. That's definitely not a little swimming. Why were you already swimming? You guys are about to swim now, right? Isn't that why you're all meeting up? It wasn't for my enjoyment. I was trying to see if I could swim to a different island. Can you? Well, even though if I find that it was uh, blocked away from the, the Malabies since we can't get in. Can you see it? Just gonna swim out of it. Huh? But I couldn't find any other islands. It seems it may be difficult to leave this island by swimming. If you didn't see anything after you swam for three hours, it's more than difficult. It's impossible. Yeah, that was weird for you. I mean, how the heck can you just swim that really that fast? Yeah, that may be true. Hey. Hey, Hajime. Hmm? What? Awesome! A woman with what? Silk black hair is pretty fine too, huh? How the heck should I know, Kazuichi? Oh my my! And his face too! Man! Is it because of- Young ladies are sure well endowed nowadays. Is that a challenge against all the women in the world? It's not like a competition or anything. Fine. Ibuki accepts that challenge with the power of technology. Time to pump these puppies full of silicone. What? Don't say such asinine things. <laughs> Are you using it as a science pun? It pushes to like a silicone. <laughs> anyway, it looks like everyone is almost here. It's already past 4 o'clock p.m. If so, all that left is... is the Sonya, right? Uh, I am terribly sorry for my delay. And she's here. <laughs> Jeez, you know these yell that loud. Ah, Miss Sonya's here! She's doubled down on excitement? Oh my! What kind of sexy swimsuit is Miss Sonya's wearing? I bet it's something very, very something very s sexy. Nope, take it back. <laughs> it's a wetsuit. Well, your dream failed, Kazuichi. So sorry for you. It is to prevent sunburn. I do not want my skin to be sun damaged. Yeah, but why are you wearing a wetsuit anyway? However. As I have never worn a wetsuit before, I had a hard time putting it on, which resulted in my delay. Is that why you've been taking so long? Really? It is my bad. <laughs> oh, sure, you say, my bad. Oh, my. I give you a sorry for Kazuichi, unless his dream failed. Seeing Sonya's wearing a, a swimsuit. I see. A swimsuit. Well, Miss Sonia does have beautiful white skin. Miss Sonia! But that tight outfit of hers is amazing! 
Just what I expected from a 100% pure bread princess. Well that gets that way quick. This guy needs to quit to recover. Um. Um. Anyway, why are you two here? Uh, I'll answer that, Miss Sonia. You're gonna keep saying that it was a coincidence, is it? I'll be honest. If you're gonna go to the beach, please let us come with you. I am concerned. Well, this was originally supposed to be a girls only outing to straighten our friendship with each other. <laughs> Do you think you can make an exception? Would you please? Um, well, it's okay. It's not like there'll be any problems, even if there are some boys. Yeah, it was an all girls and two boys, so there's no point telling. Then. You're right. They came all the way here. It would be bad if we made them leave. <laughs> ah, Miss Sonia is just so kind! Alright! All right, now that they decided, let's get going! But Akane's wound is still being treated. How long does it take me to go and treat her wound? Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! There's no way I can just stand around! I'll go on ahead and prepare! I'll set up the parasols and prepare the drinks! Engines ready! I mean it! I promise I'll give her my all to serve you so everyone has fun! Who are you? It's like a seventh? With an abnormal amount of gusto, he pulled down to the diner. Um, I'm surrounded by squirrels and swimsuits. This is a little awkward. Uh, I guess he's just gonna walk away then. I, I, I should go help Kazuichi too. With some of my excuse, I ran out of the diner, almost as if I were escaping. What do you think? I guess we had to go to the beach immediately, straight towards it. Whatever. Well, it's time to get head to the beach and have a joy time with all the girls, including Katsuichi. Anyway. No! You see, it's a green and custard toys it! That, that announcement means that the body is discovered. Who was, ki was killed? Who was murdered? Huh? Th that bell just now. Could it be. A body has been discovered! Who was it? Now then, after a certain amount of time has passed, the class trial will begin! Man, it wasn't been taking a long time, does it? A, a body? Th that's a lie! I impossible! S someone... Is that called Luigi? Someone come here! <laughs> that was definitely called Luigi voice just now. It sounds like he's nearby. Maybe inside the beach house. Ah, uh, really? That quick? Ah, uh, not now. D did that scream just now come from come from here? Oh, uh, hold on, guys. I need to wait for a bit. Did that scream just now come from here? Cautiously, I reach my hand towards the doorknob. As I twist the doorknob and try to open the door, it won't open. Does something happen from the inside? It's locked. No, this is different. It's like something is blocking the door from the other side. Okay, it can like... It can pull, but it's only a push. What does this mean? I guess we're in the choice to go to the ulterior one. Oh my god, it's really that slow for doing this, is it? <laughs> Cause we just scream. Did I really hear it come from here? No. What am I being nervous about? There's no reason for me to be nervous. For a discovery announcement. I won't believe it. I'm not going to believe it. There's no way I'll believe it. It's just like Terry 2 says, I, I won't believe it. Who would believe something like that? As I raise my voice, I swiftly step inside the beach house. God damn it, who is it? I won't believe it. Just like what Terry 2 has said. The moment I step inside the beach house, those words mercilessly shatter into pieces. Who was it? Oh no, that's a lot of blood. Oh god, what is it? My hero? No, my hero! And a mask? It, it. This was all a dream. When did I. When did I begin dreaming? Oh my god, now it's my hero's got murdered? If this is reality, why is my hero on the floor covered in blood? I couldn't understand anything that was in front of me. And I couldn't believe in my s anything. Huh? 
Oh god. Chapter 2. Sea Punishment. Sin and Coconut. Deadly Life. Oh man, that was not very good. Mahiro Koizumi. The ultimate photographer. She had an unyielding force of personality, but she was actually very good at taking care of people. Well, she being bossy is whatever. And she was always straightforward towards us and toward herself. She was always facing toward. She was that kind of person. Why her? Why my hero? Why? Why did this happen to her? The muscle in my face stiffened and grew hard. Darkness clouded my vision. My legs started to wobble, and I tensely placed my hand against the wall. Hey, Hajime, before this, we were having a great time, right? We were it, too. We were ex excited about going to the beach. We were having a lot of fun. But why? Are you kidding me? Why does something like this happen? Someone tell me! I obviously don't know what's going on either. Oh! Uh huh? Um. Um, are you gonna grow up? <laughs> yep, I knew it! You're gonna just gonna burp up bubbles. <laughs> now is not the time to make bubbles! Hurry get the others! Ibuki instantly left the beach house. I'm sure it took some time for everyone else to come here. They had to change and whatnot and must have taken some time, which you can change in the beach house. But I didn't really know how much time had passed. My senses were numbed. My emotions were also numbed. Within me, various layers were peeling off. My sense started to return around the time I realized that the others were already here. Huh? What the heck is this? Ah! Hey! Why my hero? The girls were standing outside the door leading to the beach, their face pale with terror. Something like this? For heaven's sake! What in the world is going on? May you go change really that quick, don't you? With their pale face with still instinct, the girls began wobbling towards the beach house. Until a voice stopped them. Hold it. Ah, uh, hold on a sec. Hmm. They'll stay beneath you. Be careful not to step on them. What? Beneath? What is it? See? You know, the footprints are under the door. Really? I didn't see it. There are footprints leading out to the beach house, right? That's probably an important clue. Oh. I see. I guess this might be very important to like who left the beach house or who went inside the beach house. So... So, don't step on them. Huh? If you mean evidence. I'm gonna come imagine it in the announcement, right? After a certain amount of time, we'll hold a class trial. What the? Another class trial? You serious? Then are you saying this is... Yep, she was murdered. That's right. That's right. One of you guys killed her. Well, there's no way that none of the girls were here, but neither was as well. Hey, hey! It's not like an accident or something. Lie. You guys think that's an accident? That still means this death was caused by someone else's actions, right? In other words, that doesn't count as a legitimate murder. No such deaths fall into gray area on this island. I will make sure it's clear to you guys. On this island, dying from sickness is basically the only death that. Nah, consider a murder. <laughs> well, it's impossible to get sick and die on this island. Not when Mami takes such good care of people. <laughs> what does that supposed to mean? What's this? Oh, speaking of which. I don't like this. There he is. Your sonic treatment attack. This is like the number one thing that hurts me. How the heck is supposed to be possible? Mami start crying. <laughs> well, fine. I'm not gonna lose to you, bashing. I decided to become a tough kid. This is... It's the worst. Once again, this is a horrible nightmare. Another victim. And it's all because of Monokuma. No way! She did not my fault. Huh? The whose fault is it, you ask? Yeah. To find out, we hold the class trial. So... So... Let's begin already. No way! Just begin already. It's... The Monokuma file! Of course, you can do the sound effect thing, the, like, the Monokuma file thing. 
Okay, I shall pass out the Monokuma Fire number two. This show starts to feel familiar. Do your best. Now then, do your very best to investigate. I'll see you later at the class trial. But what about the others? <laughs> class trial. Investigation. This is horrible. It's just so horrible. Hey. Then you should have stopped the murder before it occurred. Don't you have that kind of power? <laughs> I did have the power before he appeared. Perhaps. Even if she tried to stop it. Judging from Monokuma and Monami's relationship, there's no doubt she can't stop herself. Of course, because you think it might be brother sister related. Yes. Monokuma took everything away, including the magic stick and the surveillance cameras. The only thing they can rely on are these ears. But now they can only hear about three times than a normal person. So basically. So basically, you have no idea what's happening on this island on, in the first place. <sighs> I'm just the worst! A powerless rapper like me is the worst! <laughs> hey, now's not the time to focus on something like that. More importantly, what should we do? <laughs> do we have to do it again? That's a cruel thing! We have to do it again? We have no choice, right? Either that or we're done for. Why? I cannot believe it. My hero was killed by one of us. Damn it! Yeah! I can't do this anymore! Investigating the class trial. Seriously, I'm done! Aaron feels the same. But we can't do anything else except do it. And... There's no way we can just ignore the reason my hero was killed. Hey. Yes. Yeah. The only thing we can do is investigate. Cause it's bad. Cause... We should never forgive that. Killing. It's something we should never forgive. That's what you said, uh, from the motive. Shucky. Well? The killer has their reasons. I understand that. It was the same for Terry too, too. It's really all Monokuma's fault. I understand that, too. But, even so, um, we should never forgive. I'll never allow it. We should never forgive. Killing. She usually has her head in the clouds, so for her to say something like that, she's probably can't forgive this at all. But that's true of me, too. Understood. Regardless, everyone's going to die if we don't do it. In order for us all to survive, we must do it. I'm gonna do it! Now let's do this! Perhaps. Mahiro probably want us to do this, too. She will want us to reveal the truth behind her death. I understand. I never was doing it. I would do it too, but, 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 please give me a little time. Please give me time to calm myself down a little. Also, I'll go and tell the others who aren't there here about this. You're right. If you're hurt, you have heard what's the announcement. You won't know where the murder took place. <laughs> I shall excuse myself for now. Hey. Then let's begin. Who okay, killed my hero Koizumi? Why was she killed? We gotta find that and solve this already. That's right. We have to do it. It's the only way. I don't want to do this, but that's more than reasons for us to finish this. I'm the only one who can do this. <laughs> Investigated time. We're not doing it just yet. First, I need to take a look at the Malakuma file. Let's see what her purpose is or what her death is. The victim is Mahiro Koizumi. It's been time of death is around 3 o'clock p.m. That's the exact, exact time that when we were king and waited for the girls. The scene of the crime where the body was discovered is inside the beach house at Candelaria Beach. The cause of death is a single killing blow to the head with a blunt instrument. Okay, that's kind of really that hard, is it? There are no other special external injuries and no trace of foreign substance such as drugs. Okay, I'm not any sign of drugs, but only to squack it. Unless she must have been attacked from behind. Around 3 o'clock p.m. That's the time Katsuichi and I arrived at the diner. But if we had just gone to the beach house instead, no, that's not the time to feel regret. I need to focus on doing as much as I can right now. And then, I'm going to find out the truth behind my hero's death. That's the only way the rest of us can survive. I'm gonna come and find number two. I guess we got the investigation started. What? 
Not yet, because we gotta leave it here since it's almost time is up. So I'm gonna leave it here since I'm not sure. It almost feels like an hour is up, but since the investigation starts, that's how I'm gonna leave it here. So we're gonna have to do it next week. Since I'm not sure how long for investigation will it take, but like I said, um, I will just go keep like make a full recording of all the investigation as I can so far, so make it fast as possible. But then after that, we can do the class trial, just like I did last time, we make it like an hour video recording, make a separate part of videos, make it a 30 minutes part, so that way, it'll make it easier and make it as fast as possible, so we won't be take forever to do such, so anyway, we're just gonna wait for half hour tech, so anyway, that's pretty much it for Dunga Mapa 2, goodbye, despair, if you like this video, hit that like button too, light them up, if you wanna see my videos, or check out the other physical subscriber, until then, I'll see you guys next time. Later!